Hello, Scrabble here with more Enter the Gungeon on the Nintendo Switch. Today I am doing a run, if you can't tell, as the robot. The robot is not my favorite character. I hate picking up hearts when I'm the robot. But I probably like the robot better than the pilot. Hashtag the pilot did nothing wrong. I even think I might like the design of the robot better than I like the design of the pilot. The robot... I think he's probably the cutest character. Oh! Which makes it a little funny that I don't like his appearance as much. Oh, a shield! Yes, thank you! Thank you! The robot very much loves you. There we go. The robot's starting weapon is fantastic. Looks like we got an ammo belt. Really helps with our infinite ammo. Okay, maybe not, but it will help in the future when we don't have infinite ammo. Eh, I don't care for you, bouncy boy. We got bouncy boys, we got tazy boys. Tazy boys don't show up till the next floor. There we go. Of course there's more waves. Always more waves. We have played enough Gungeon that while the first floor is easy, they don't try to make it easy. They try to make it a little tough for us. There we go. Um, I think I gotta open it, right? Oh yeah, 50 bucks and a blunderbuss, which I think is complete trash. If I can sell the blunderbuss, I will do so. Okay, and up we go. Sorry this video is out late today and I had no video yesterday. I have been working on Switching my recording software from Elgato Capture HD whoa, to Streamlabs OBS. It is a little rougher on my computer. Um, I'm not using a great computer. That is still something to come. My wife and I agreed before that if I keep my channel up and continue recording for a year, then we can invest in a better computer for me. But if not, then no. So, we're getting to that point, right? Oh, garbage. I should have paid more attention and less attention to my talking. That's what we get. You might think that it's easy to play and talk at the same time. I find it is often not easy to play and talk at the same time. And usually, you need to practice it because it's hard to maintain your converse, your, uh, concentration while talking. But that is a skill that can correlate to a whole bunch of different things. In any case, uh, I have switched over to Streamlabs, and I spent a lot of time fiddling with different settings. And I think I finally have some settings down where the quality is something that I'm okay with for the amount of power needed on my machine. Okay, not a mimic. And pop over to here. Up we go. We've seen some, uh, did see a weird mimic recently with a boss pedestal mimic. That was the very first time I'd encountered that. Here we go. Oh, hey, shopkeeper, shopkeeper. What do you got for us? We have a lot of money. We do not need supply drop. We do not need escape rope. We do want a key. Uh, I would normally take the armor. Robot can use all the armor he can get his hands on. But I'm not going to, and the reason for that is I want the cash for the key. Uh, this drum clip? Oh god. This floor has no good weapons for me. I'm gonna be on starter pistol here. Fortunately, the starter weapon's pretty good. Uh, we have no way of getting through there. Maybe the boss will drop a key, and maybe I'll be interested enough to pick it up. Bullet King! So, our sub-weapon does nothing. Still fine. Oh! Bull! Yeah, I'll try the blunderbuss. I think it's a garbage weapon. I really think it's a garbage weapon. Yeah, 
Yeah, guess what? You fire nothing. Ah. Robot, we are not doing so good on this boss, man. Really disappointed in our performance there. Part of it is probably the crappy blunderbuss. But you know what's not crappy? These hearts. No, I'm just kidding. They're crappy. What's not crappy is this commando. You're fired, which has... Oh! A mammo belt! Wow. I have no idea what the synergy is, but it looks cool. And I'm sure it'll shred bosses. Excellent. Really happy to pick that up. Boss shredders. Always a good time. In addition to a better PC to be able to record um, at a higher quality and do a little bit more video editing. Um, if I could do more video editing, I could do reviews that I'm happy with. Right now I do quick looks and I stop at quick looks and I don't do reviews because my ability to edit videos is really low. I do not have much ability to actually do any sort of editing. I can clip. Clipping I can do. I just installed Lightworks, which uh, doesn't seem too bad. Whoa! But, but, my machine is not powerful when it comes to video editing. It's not powerful when it comes to anything. With a stronger PC, I would also be able to take a look at some PC games. Um, maybe. I, I kind of like my Switch focus. I'll probably stay focused on Switch, but I could look at some PC titles that I want to take a look at. Come on, Keyboy. Got him. Okay, I wasn't sure. Oh, man. Poisonous Blobby Lord? I have not seen one of them. Okay, up we go. Do the shop. Look, shop, I got more than 100 bucks now. We are getting very close. Heavy boots, I don't care for. E, I'll pick up. Uh, what do we got? Oh, we got a gun muncher. We only have one gun that I want to munch right now. Let's see what else we pick up. There we go. Oh, good, a heart! Thank you! Thank you, game! I am almost positive the game drops more hearts when you're the robot. Sounds like... Sounds like a crazy theory. But it's a crazy theory that I think is true. Okay, up here. Whoa. Yeah, I don't want to get hit with tasers. No tazy boys, thanks. This is the no tazy boys allowed club. No tazy boys! We're allowed to have one, Homer. Yep, say no thank you to those guys. No thank you to the boss right now. Although, again, that commando would probably just shred him. I still like to pick up my items first. But Scrabble, that boss you're gonna absolutely destroy, he is going to drop a uh, item. Don't you want that item he's gonna drop? I do. I really do. But this isn't a hard stage, and we're gonna check out what is up here first. All right. Some more avoidance. And up we go. There we go. Whew. Globulons. Way easier with the bullet. But just fine here too. And the bullet's probably the most OP character. Probably has the best starting weapon. There's not much that's bad about the bullet. Oh! Oh, I dodged a little too late. 
That was bad. Come on, man. That is not how we... That is not how we win this game. You know, we win this game by avoiding damage, not taking it. Also, with awesome synergies. Ooh, Betrayer's Shield. I like Betrayer's Shield. I can use this. I can use this? This is a... This is a weapon that'll do something for me. And the other items down here. We will switch over to Betrayer's Shield. Look at this. Like... I wonder if this holds up... Oh no, it gets cracked. So it's like, I wonder if it holds up against the dragon. Almost definitely it doesn't. If it did, Blockner wouldn't have died to me. He would have beat that dragon. Killed his own past. I wonder what's in Blockner's past that he feels he must kill. That was really bad, and I immediately lost my Guan Stone. Say this Blockner's gun has pretty good precision. It doesn't stray very far at all. Here we got this eye patch. Hit harder, less often. Uh, well, that's probably pretty good because we're going to be using a homing missile. And we are going to not key. We only owe 166. 166 and the key is ours. That's a good price. And we're gonna go ahead and blow this guy away. Oh, come on. Oh, hey, you know what would be awesome? If every time we fought a second floor boss, it was the Anaconda. Ah! Oh. That'd be just great. In fact, that should be a feature of the game. You get far enough, you only ever fight Snake. I only got hit once. That was a that was a pretty decent snake fight. So hit harder less often and and pick up this. Uh we're gonna go back to the treasure shield. Hope we pick up some ammo on the next floor. We got an extra 14 bucks, but we'll carry that forward. And continue to owe $166 on the key. Not a bad price. Remember the uh, the original Prime Primer cost 110 and you had to have that all at once. The Oubliette was not required, but certainly made that more helpful. In fact, I think if we did an Oubliette run the next time, we would probably be able to get our $166, depending on... I mean, if we take the bullet, then we don't have to buy anything in the first floor, because the bullet's good enough. I think we might do that. All right, let's go. Woo! We got the table slide, boys. Woo! And our betrayer shield makes his own table, essentially. Whoa! There you go, great. Okay! Alright, through that. When do I pick up the extra armor? Did the boss drop an armor? I don't remember. He could have. He very well could have, and I could have missed it. Uh, let's see here. You're still alive. Of course, I'm still alive. Scatter shot. Absolute garbage. Absolute garbage scatter shot. Never ever ever pick that up. So terrible. And I like that its description sounds good, but no. Absolute terrible item. I kind of wonder if it has better synergies with advanced Dungeons and dragons, but as far as I know, it did not get fixed to do what you think it should do. Oh, he went up. There we go. Oh, yeah, 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 up we go. I'm gonna follow along. And head this way. Got him. Here, blow him up. Thanks, Nitra. You know, this weapon's pretty hot. 
I do like what it's doing for us. Oh, a key 47. I wish we had keys. Lament configure them, which I can never resist, but usually doesn't do anything for us. But the a key 47, three keys. If only I had them, I absolutely would. It unlocks everything just with its bullets. It's a good item, Bront. Yeah, more hearts. Still think the game drops way more hearts when you're the robot. And you can't put that past a game that just keeps adding more mimics. Oh, I walked right into it. I walked right into it. I'm a terrible, terrible gamer. We only have 12 bullets left. Um, this allows us... I couldn't remember what it did before. It allows us to siphon... damage. Like, uh, siphon hearts from enemies that we are close to. Okay, no ammo, so we are back to our starting pistol, because... Uh, we only have four commando shots. is going really bad. And of course they give us one of these. Whoa! The shame is real, folks. The shame is real. Thank you so much for watching! If you've enjoyed, click the like button if you want to see more Enter the Gungeon Advanced Gungeons and Dragons content. Then subscribe. Despite how shamed I feel at this run, uh, we really, I mean, the commando was great. Getting screwed over with the blunderbuss and the lack of ammo for Blockner's weapon. Um, Kind of hurt us, I think, but uh, still, I should be able to beat the first three floors with just the starting weapon. Um, the robot's kind of tough. Again, I'm making lots of excuses. I didn't play well. That's that's what we'll go with. Go ahead and share the video. Leave a comment. I love responding to comments. Thanks again for watching. Take care. I will see you next time.